Hey, what's going on? This is Ross Omari of sqsptheme.com. If you've ever wanted to play with the Commerce API and you are not a developer, I'm going to show you how you can actually um, get some of that data and play with it a little bit. Pause. So, um, one, you need a, a Commerce account with Squarespace. And then if you go to your settings, um, advanced Squarespace API keys, you'll be able to create a key. And then the tool that we're using here is called Parabola. Um, and these guys were kind enough to help me figure this out. So um, you plug your key in here under bearer token. You've got your API endpoint, which is um, it's right here. Oh, maybe I can click and highlight. There you go. All right. Paste it there. And then um, the guys at Parabola were able to help me figure out what these extra settings are that I needed. So you've got next page cursor here, here under pagination key. And again, under cursor key. And then the top level key result. And then boom, I've got all of the um, all of the order data in here. Now, um, the next step would be to kind of massage that data. So we've got this JSON flattener, which what this does, it unpacks um, certain packets of data. So your billing and shipping information and your line items, um, they're going to be kind of packed. And so this is going to let you unpack it. And then you've got a column filter here, which you can filter out columns that you don't need to see with information that you're not going to you know, use. And then you can reorder those columns and then finally export it into a Google Sheet. And then when you hit publish, you have the actual option to schedule this and have it run you know, once per day or once every hour on certain days of the week. All right. So now whenever you want to see, you know, whatever your order data is, you can just go straight to the Google sheet and you don't have to manually export your orders and I don't know, copy and paste them somewhere or whatever it is that you'd have to do otherwise. So um, I definitely, definitely recommend this if, if this is something that uh, some that you need it's a, it's an easy, easy solution, um, and it's made for people who, like me and you, who don't know how to do this API code stuff, but we can um, string a couple of functions together. All right, peace.